All right, we're back. Now, I, I've seen your character before, but I, I'm i blanking on her name because I'm horrible on this. Who's your character? Yoko from Gurren Lagann. From what? Gurren Lagann. Now, what is that series about? It's basically, it's about an adventure. Uh, it starts off as three characters, Simon, Kamina, and Yoko. And they all meet each other in a weird quink dink. And they're, they're basically, all, they all live underground. And they're out to go explore space and time. Yeah. Like space and time? Yeah. How do they explore both space and time? Um, they have these giant robots. that they, They're called Megabots. And they go around in them. And they fight these evil creatures called the Antispirals. The anti spirals, yeah. Okay. They're out to destroy the them because they're s it's really confusing. They're out to destroy them because they're the good spirals and the anti spirals want to get rid of them because they're eventually gonna blow up everything. Okay. <laughs> I am impressed by your weapon. Can you hold this up or, or hold it side? This is as tall well, however, this is as tall as you and bigger than even in widescreen that we can show. Is there a name for this weapon? Uh C uh, Cody, what's it called? A bar at 50 caliber sniper. A bar at 50 caliber oh, Cody, sniper. Cody, you might as well come in here. If you have the, Cody, now Cody has the information. We noticed, we noticed him earlier. Let's make room for Cody if you want to step over. Uh, are you from the same anime? Yeah, my character is Kamina. Now, what is your relation to Yoko? Um, we're secret lovers towards the beginning and then in the, last, in the last episode of the first series, which is the eighth episode, Kamina dies and that's right after he confesses his love to her. Why don't I step between you guys that way I don't have to cover anybody cover anybody up. Now, you what is her weapon again? It's a Barra 50 caliber sniper rifle with an ACOG scope. Oh, okay. You you seem really knowledgeable. I mean, are you nearly knowledgeable about the anime or just weapons? Oh, uh, just weapons. Just weapons. So so how much damage can this thing do? It'll put a hole the size of a bowling ball in the back of your head. Alright. <laughs> cool. So and now, I, I definitely noticed you were in your line. This is a very, uh, I mean, both of you, very, very, uh, for anyone else would be brave, but you guys are fortunately in better shape than anyone I know. So, so, so why, now, what's the symbolism of your tattoos? Um, other than the fact that on my back, I know that's oh, fire. Well, turn around, because. <laughs> other than that, I have no idea. She's the anime. The back one's fire, this one's earth, and this one's water. Now, do you have corresponding abilities that relate to this? No. We're just, in the anime, it's just normal human beings piloting giant robots. Now, <laughs> she has a massive weapon over here. What do you, do you not have a weapon? I run around with a katana, but they wouldn't let me bring it in. Oh, okay. I've been hearing that today. So, for you, what was the most challenging part of this? Trying to get these pants to work. <laughs> You got some panels. You want to pan down? He put this. He put the most detail in. The so, what was the challenging part of the pants? For us? Well, we tried making a pair, and it didn't work out because my legs are—they just wouldn't fit, you know. So we gave up, and then we found these, and we just figured, why not? You know, glue some red stripes to them, make them work. So. Well, I'm not familiar with the enemy, but it does look good. It does not look thrown together. Now, how did this take the longest amount of time? Probably. Probably. Did you did you have to? Well, obviously you didn't apply this year. Did you help him with this? I had to do it all. <laughs> so he was ha he was asleep while you half did asleep, this. Yeah. Half asleep. How long did that take you to do? Probably like a half hour, hour something like that. <laughs> wow. So this morning of all times. Yeah, it's just body paint. It's, still, yeah, I mean, it came out nice. Yeah. So what was the most challenging part of your cost? Everything. Everything. Um, Probably the boots because I made these. You made here. I'll hold up my leg. Um, I there's a there's a heel inside of these like a store bought heel. Okay. And I made a boot cover to go around the heel. As oh. you can see, it's on the bottom. It's just material. Yeah. And then I had to paint on the flames. Okay. But these probably took me the longest to make. All right. And did I mean? The rest of it's everything's made. Everything else. Everything. You made. Everything except for these. I did not make these. You did not make the no. stockings. You In the wig, I didn't make the wig, but I just had to buy and then style. Now what's the um? It's a little skull. It's just her attitude. It's just. She's her got attitude. that little badass okay. attitude. Okay. So can we see the? Is there any details on the back we need? No. Nope. Except for the fact that look at wait I want to I want to show butt. how long this is. Hand down so we can see, nearly reaching the floor. 
Yeah. She's got really, really long hair, and I wanted, I'm a stickler for, I'm a perfectionist, so I wanted to make sure it was all the way down. <laughs> now, is everything on, like, does she also have, I don't know if you can get this, does she also have a belly ring? Or no, no, it's not supposed to be there. It's not supposed to be there? No, she doesn't have any piercings, so it's not supposed to be there. Oh, are you hiding? Uh, uh, yeah, I'm hiding many others. What about, now is there, is that hers? This? Her, no, the, the, necklace? the necklace. No, that's not hers. That's also hidden. Oh, that's also hidden. <laughs> I, I don't take it off, oh, unfortunately. Okay. Cool. That, that is some. And now, now did you make this weapon? I mean, he's familiar with it, but did you make this weapon? I had my friend uh, Matt make this for me. He made it for me in about two weeks. It's made out of. Uh, this is here is foam, uh, PVC pipe, and the scope actually works if you look through it. Cool. Sorry. Hold on. Hold on. Very hard to position. Can you see through it? Yeah, I can. Cool. You want to bring it closer to the camera and show them some, some of the details? Right. Here. Here. We got this? All right. Pan down. Pan. So, yeah. all right. Yes. It's a real working scope. Um, it's got a foam trigger. It, this, unfortunately, the clip does not come out. This is the stand form for it. I don't trust putting it out, though. And let's see. Everything, it's basically just acrylic paint with a polymer coat over top of it, so it's waterproof. Now, you're very dedicated because, I mean, most, cos, most cosplayers I know would have probably just bought a Nerf long shot and repainted it. So that, it, it, yeah. this was that important to you. Yeah, Yoko is probably my favorite character, and I really love the series because it's just got, it's really upbeat series, it's got a really good attitude to it, and Yoko's my favorite character because we tend to have the same personality, she's just a fun going badass who does not care what other people think. <laughs> so, oh, <laughs> come on, we're trying to get out good, of here. Good. Uh -huh. So is she, a, is she a fun loving badass? Yeah, she's <laughs> a pain in the ass in the series too. And, and is she a pain in the ass in real life? Sometimes. Oh, okay. <laughs> and what's his character like? Uh, his character is the goofy, um, fun-loving douchebag. Yeah. <laughs> is, is he a goofy, fun-loving douchebag? Definitely. All right. Cool. Well, you guys, thank you very much. I think they're awesome costumes. I definitely will have to check out this anime. Thank, thank you. you.